Hi everyone, it's Tammy and it's Saturday morning. Um, so I'm just getting ready and I thought um, I would just do a quick get ready with me and at the same time I can show you um, I got the lip plumpers. They come in a bag like this and there's two different sizes. Um, I think one gives you a different look. I did this one just a while ago but I prefer this one. So all you do is make sure that it's a little bit wet around your lips so that when you suck on it, it stays. And then you, the um, blood and the, um, the, your uh, water will get to your lips and plump them up. And then I find when I do that, it gets rid of these lines. So in about five minutes, they'll plump up. I do it a little bit longer than that, but I've done it um, for about five minutes already. So just make sure that the suction is not too much because then your lips may bruise. So just do it gently enough where you can kind of feel that little bit of a tingling, but not where it's hurting. <laughs> okay, so I put my... Um, CoverGirl 3-in-1 on, and then my Garnier um, roller ball that I showed you, I use that under my eyes and just in the um, lines on the side of my face. And then I'm going to use my Maybelline Brow Drama, and I just take that and kind of color in my brows. My eye seems a little bit better today. I think you can see it better now that I don't have makeup on. It may, may be a uh, bell palsy is a is a virus, and uh, but usually it affects like the facial area here, and it it hasn't. So it may just be. I don't know. I don't know what it may be. But I'm not I'm not worried about it. It'll go away. It seems better today. Okay. And I'm just gonna take some of the banana powder and I'm just gonna pop some of that underneath my um, my eyes to set the concealer. So I just take my just any sponge I have. I have this one on hand. It is so cold here today. I cannot wait for summer. Poor Bailey goes out and she freezes. Okay. And then I'm just winging this today. I have nowhere special to go, but I don't like being without makeup on. Okay, and then I'm going to take my Real Techniques and my Bahama Mama. Just do a little bit of contour. I suppose with all blonde hair color, I'm going to still get that kind of, um, I guess it's like a light gold tinge to it. And I don't know, it bothers me. I, I like the color, it's just it bothers me because I just do not want any signs of red in there. Um, it's not red. I just got to keep telling myself that because I... I do it, I love it, and then I see a little bit of that, and I said, oh, i got to put a darker dye in, but I'm not going to do that. I just have to go with it. Okay, and then I'm going to take some of my Luminoso. I got the droppies today. And I'm just going to pop some of that on. 
And then the, usually this isn't dark enough, but I really like the kind of a flush that it gives to my skin and a little bit of a highlight. And I, I'll pop a little bit of a blush just on the apples if it's not dark enough for me. And then I just wipe off this brush because I need a big one for my powder. So I have to keep using this one twice. And then I have my Laura Mercier in. And I gotta get my glasses. Rich Vanilla. Just bring that down. Okay. And I made a mess. Got powder all over the table, all over my glasses. Not a girl. Okay. Now we're I'm all over the place. Okay. 50 million lipsticks in my makeup bag for work. And I'm just going to take my, um, I think this is Milani lip liner. I can feel the plumping. They are bigger. Okay. Um, I got... Where did I put it? I got a new eyeshadow yesterday. Where did I put it? I never have anything ready, eh, guys. I'm just so unorganized when I do videos, and that's awful. But you love me anyway. This one. Um, this one's called. Uh, Sombra Rills Darrows. No, that's not the name. Doesn't have it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Anyway, it's this one. And the sun, well, the sun. It's light out, but there really isn't sun. Is in my eyes. Okay. So I'm going to take this color here. I love these kind of brownish, burnt orange. I find it brings my green out in my eyes. This one, um, I was doing... I was doing the CoverGirl, because all we carry at work is CoverGirl, right? Now. Well, we won't be able to carry any other ones, but I was doing the um, display, and I saw this color, and I, I really liked it. So I thought I'd give it a try. And then I just take the darker, I think it's like a purple, and I just run that under my eyes. Lately, I haven't been wearing eyeliner because my eyes, have, they water a lot. And I'm wondering if that's what it's from. Okay, now lipstick. I don't know if I should just put a gloss on. Let's see. Okay. 
go. I really like this MAC lipstick. The color is uh, Angel. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay. Now, we're going to curl the eye lashes and use my clump crusher. Yeah, I'm really glad I got those lip plumpers. They work really good. I didn't buy the really expensive one. This one I think was around 22. I bought the small and they sent me another size as well, which surprised me. But I like it because it does do, it, it makes a big difference for me when I look in the mirror. I can't see as many lines around my lips because it's plumped up. that um, I was using the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes, this one. It was um, just a trial. I think Patty sent me this. Anyway, it was just a trial. I like it. It does a really good job, but it I find it transfers on me anyway. I may put a little bit of a darker color in the outer corner of my eye. Yeah, this is a good mascara for sure. Sorry if my voice is low. I still, that cold is still hanging on. You see the length that gives me already? And I like it because it is buildable. The only thing I don't like is those, the brushes are, are um, like a plastic and I poke myself in the eye all the time. I'm just going to get <clears throat> my flat iron going so I can do my bangs. And this is pretty much what I do in the morning to get ready <clears throat> for work. So what you're seeing is what I do for work. And I'm really enjoying my new clothes to wear. It's fun getting dressed up for work. I, you know, I can't overdress, um, but it's nice to get made up and wear jewelry. And the girls are so wonderful there. I get nice hugs and I meet nice customers. Okay, I'm going to try and pop some color in the outer V, I guess. So I'm going to take that same color that I lined under my eyes with, and I think I'm going to try and pop some of that in the outer V here. I wish I knew how to do my eyes like you guys do. You do such a great job. It's hard with hooded eyes, I'll tell you that. And mine are so hooded that Pretty soon I just won't be able to see it. The, the, fat, the flap is just going to fall over my eyeball. That's what's going to happen. The joys. The joys of getting older. But I've pretty much always had hooded eyes, so. Never knew I had them till I came on here. I didn't know that's even what they were called. I need to get in here. This is what I have a problem with. Let's bring this up a bit. 
so that we can see it. I get so nervous because I don't want too much color up there and then I look funny. Okay, so we're going to go right into that crease and then we're going to bring it up a little bit. I watch y'all do it. Seriously, every time I do a video, the phone rings. I'm not answering it right now, sorry. Sorry, whoever's calling. Okay, so yeah, like I said, I'm going to need a little bit more pink on my cheeks, so I'm going to take... I really like this e.l.f. blush, but I want to so bad try the hourglass. It's just I cannot see myself paying that kind of money for hourglass for a blush. That one or the Clinique, you know the one that has the flower in it? I wanted to try that one too. It looks so pretty. But the e.l.f. one does the job. Okay. I always curl my lashes even after I put my mascara on. I know it's not good. I do it anyway. I was able to go through some of my makeup because <clears throat> with new stuff coming in I try and you know get rid of the stuff that's been kind of sitting I don't like to waste it so I made some bags up and gave them to people and now I can make room for some new stuff see good. I find the uh, videos were a lot better when I was in front of the window. Now I'm to the side of it, but that's the way it's going to be now that we changed the living room around. I'm going to tackle changing my bedroom around today and get away from that, that uh, breeze that's coming in our wonderful windows. I think they definitely need to be changed. So I had put a, a message on my uh, Facebook and I wanted to know um, when I go hunting for jewelry, I'd prefer, seriously, I'd prefer that you maybe tell me the kinds of things that you like or, you know, not that you're going to buy, but just like to see and that way I can pick out more specific pieces that I know that you'll enjoy. Um, so yeah, if you want to leave a comment underneath this video as to some of the things you like um, or that you're looking for. It would help me a lot so that um, I can do better picking. Okay, I'll probably put a few more coats on there. And I can't find the one because it's a mess here so I'm just going to use my brush. take my flat iron because of the way I sleep my hair in the front usually gets messed up but I still have a lot of the curl from yesterday when I curled it with the flat iron and then I, I like to try and take some of those um, pieces down that I cut I'm gonna play with my hair today and work on some different hairstyles That's about it, guys. Anyway, I'll see you later. Um, yeah, give those uh, lip plumpers a try. You'll really enjoy them. Talk soon. Bye-bye.